Hello, I'm Dr. Oliver, and I'm here today with the USPA uh, Polo Development Player Performance Analysis. And we're going to talk about the theory behind some of um, the performance analysis exercises and stuff that we are going to begin to start doing. And the theory behind that is that the body is, um, we consider the body as a kinetic chain. So you have interdependent segments that are linked together. So everything from our feet, linked knees, hips, on up, where to our upper extremity, our shoulder, elbow, and hand. So if everything's linked together, that is how we can generate so much more energy if we actually pay attention to what all of the links are doing. So uh, we like to have what we call proximal stability for distal mobility. So for me to swing the mallet as hard as I can, then I need to utilize my lower half. If I can utilize my lower half and I can funnel the energy up, then I'm gonna be able to swing harder versus if I just try to do the whole swing with my shoulder. So we focus a lot on the pelvis, or a lot of times we'll call that the core, or we'll call it the lumbopelvic hip complex. So this lumbopelvic hip complex is very important in the kinetic chain because that's your link. That's your link from where you can generate the most energy. You can generate the most energy from the lower extremity, generate it up through a stable core, through my lumbopelvic hip complex so that I can then funnel the energy on out through my shoulder, elbow, wrist, and hand to the mallet. So if I can funnel that energy, then it's easy for me to make the hard swing because I'm not having to generate the energy from my shoulder. I'm generating it from the larger muscles of the lower half.